We are not done yet. <laughs> yeah, but we do extras because we have requests. <laughs> Put that in there. <laughs> But the guy from Russia went into 3D mode. Yeah. Like that was the difference. That was awesome. He kicked it up a notch. I like how they dress out like they're going to a football game. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like they're going to an athletic event. But That's how you support your they country. They're super fans. Uh, Conchita, you should see this one. It took us over the top when we were watching it. It was just like test clutch. What? Rise like a phoenix. I was like, what? It was legit. This video is legit. <laughs> legit. Legit. Look, like you become a U Eurovision fan from watching this video. I feel the same. <laughs> Just so much hope and promise. That waist is snatched. A stranger getting nearer. Who can this person be? Oh, it looks like a doll. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the phoenix! Yeah! I'm telling you! And now she goes into it. The next mm -hmm. year. Yes. What's gonna happen? I'm so nervous. It just broke off. Get it! You see, you see the, the fan blowing? Mm -hmm. I love this song. I love this song too. It's just the message is really cool. Yeah. was done with the phoenix in the back. Look! Yes! Uh -huh. She saw all of that. Yes. All of that. And just like that, you're That's a vision beautiful. fan. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very Look much. Look at that. Oh, the song is Susavik. And actually the movie is, was filmed... <laughs> it does that to you. The movie was filmed in... Um, 2019. So they have used the actual stage of Eurovision. They oh. they booked like the stage for like two days or however long they needed to film the stage parts, mm -hmm. and it's the, the actual true stage. Oh, you're talking about the Will Ferrell movie? Yes. Okay. 
How did they book the stage though when it didn't happen in 2020? No, it was 2019. 2019. It's a stage oh. from 2019. Oh, got it. Yes, the movie is really fun. It's on, on Netflix. It's funny without being offensive, which in the beginning I thought Will Ferrell is going to do something stupid about it. Uh huh. And I just just when I heard the name Will Ferrell is going to make a movie, I'm like, oh, oh no, no. He ever. was still stupid and silly, <laughs> but it but it didn't take away from the context. Yes. Oh, okay. Like they still made Eurovision to be like very. But it's actually his story. Like he wants, since he was a kid, to go to Eurovision to compete, but oh. he's actually really bad and doofus. Yeah. So he's like with this girl that's like really good and she has like ideas for like what the songs should be and everything But she's like very stubborn. He only wants what he wants Aww. and she's just like going with him because she loves him Oh, I'm gonna have to watch yeah, it. Yeah, it's really good. So this is the song Well, I don't know it as my hometown as it's here. I know it as Husavik. Yeah, that's the name of the song the way I know. She's lip-syncing. Yeah. Also, they're supposed to be Iceland in Eurovision. Uh. Yeah, that's like one of the plots of the movies. Like, we can never win if the song is not in English. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. Also, you don't even want to know why Will Ferrell is at the piano with oh, his raincoat even, and the scratch right. on his forehead. That's what she just said. She was like, I feel sad. I can only imagine how he got that. Everything so, you imagine. So, all the songs have to be in English in your vision? No. Oh, okay. I didn't think so. It's an Italian guy song. He looks like a fisherman. Well, you're on the right track. <laughs> Very good. You're on the right track. <laughs> Do you remember that in the movie that. there is that scene where they're like uh, in the parking lot and they're like it's so boring here and wherever that those whales are jumping on the water? <laughs> That's an actual real place. Like in Husavik, if you go, there is a place where you go and you see the whales jumping like, like that. I, I thought it's just like a stupid little barrel thing in the movie. <laughs> the like girl on, did you show? We saw the girl who sang this. We yes. saw that video. So I imagine I, he did something to Neil Patrick Harris so he wouldn't be able to play the piano and then he <laughs> did. <laughs> this is the girl. Yeah. It's an acoustic version, so it's a bit different. I just want to give her some credit because <laughs> everyone just thinks of oh, the yeah. actress. I've tried and tried again. This is actually the story of the movie. How much she wanted to be with him, and she was like so doofus. To tell the truth and not pretend. Where the mountains sing through the screams of seagulls, where the whales can't live, cause the gentle people in my hometown. My hometown. Interesting outfit. I was thinking, why did they put that raincoat on her? <laughs> so that might be because but it's, it's Iceland. Like cool but that so. one, though, with, but she has like a crop top. I think it's really worse with her eyes. I mean, I don't know, I like it. I, I see, I think I see what they try to do. Oh. That's because she has biker shorts. <laughs> But I agree that the color is The really color is nice. And she's in her bra. Yeah. Her bra, <laughs> bike shorts, and her big ass turquoise trench coat. <laughs> Nothing says Iceland. Like. <laughs> she's got a beautiful voice. She does. Though. Get it, girl. Right? Her vocals are everything. I like it. I also like that they did a very good job after the movie came out to give her enough credit. Like did a they? lot of people in the beginning thought that the actress was actually singing mm -hmm. because you know Will Ferrell is singing his mm -hmm. parts. 
and they did a very good job afterwards to credit her a lot like even on Netflix because it's a Netflix movie mm -hmm. uh, they kept mentioning her like on the YouTube page it was always like her they keep kept pushing uh, her forward so I, I like that they didn't you know because like in some movies if they're musicals and the actors cannot sing yet you don't really know who's singing it just because I, I saw her around like enough movies I yeah. think oh, they would have showed her I didn't know like what skills the actors have I think she but... did so many movies or, or by now they would have showcased her voice in something yeah that, that like if she would be able to sing so, like that probably yeah, she would get they would have got a role mm -hmm. in some Who's ready for food? Um, I can say no more. <laughs> <laughs>